Hey everybody out there, this is Seto Kaiba from your Yu-Gi-Oh! chat channel. And I hope you all had a nice Thanksgiving, guys, if you celebrated Thanksgiving. And also, you probably may notice for some of my newer viewers over the last couple months, I have no facial hair on my face. I always seem to have facial hair on my face, but last month I had a beard going because it was No Shave November, if you guys know what that is. Uh, but when I got thinking about it for a bit, I was like, wait, I've had facial hair on my face, a beard, a mustache, or something since like August or September. So <laughs> this is probably the first time I've had no facial hair on my face, you know, in a while. And I know I look completely different. Uh, but yeah, whatever. So today, guys, what I want to talk about is a topic that is kind of interesting. And we start talking about locals, and I may do some other topics uh or talks based off this topic down the road uh, later this month until the new format starts and then we'll talk about other stuff but what I want to talk about guys is playing style and specifically what we're going to talk about today in playing style is how some people I've noticed prefer one deck over another type of deck what I'm trying to say guys is if you look at yourself and you look at the players around you probably what you'll notice is certain type of players like playing certain type of decks for example, some players just like playing what is considered to be the best deck in the format, so like E-Dragons. Some people like playing uh, stun-type decks. So stun-type decks would be like uh, Evil Swarms for this format. Decks that you know counteract the number, what is considered to be the number one deck. Some people like playing Control-type decks like Hail to Perfection or Gravekeepers. Some people like playing, I think, like Spammy-type decks. And I'm not talking about dragons though they spam the board uh, I'm talking more about like gadgets you can make a lot of little fours they're kind of like a toolbox type deck I guess you could say so like toolbox spam type decks then you have your just general spam type decks that spam a lot of synchros or a lot of you know exceeds and they you know they can make what they need to get out of a certain situation or etc some people like playing a deck that just has one good boss monster Grapha scraps and scrap dragon I mean yeah, I know he's can be used in other things but he's a boss and scraps but you know what I'm trying to say and there's a whole variation uh, also OTKs I forgot I almost forgot about the OTKs some people just like running OTK type decks like you know decks that just OTK number one turn uh, some people also like playing decks that they've concocted in their basement you know like ooh let's put this card with this card and it'll be great you know, and then sometimes it's, you know, it's a great combination. It's like, oh, and it catches on. And sometimes you're just like, okay, what the heck were you thinking, boy? That doesn't work. But, you know, different players like concocting their own things or OTKs or there's a whole variation of decks out there that, you know, people can play. And then there's one other type of deck, deck I'll mention, and it's what I call unconventional type decks. Uh, I like calling them also guerrilla warfare type decks, like guerrilla warfare. If you know what that is, it's a military term. But pretty much what they're do what I'm, is, a good example of this is ghost tricks. Ghost, there's no other deck really out there kind of like ghost tricks. It's its own little thing into itself, and it's very unconventional, and it works very well. Uh, I guess Watts, Watts could be considered that, and maybe even Chain Burn could be considered that too. I guess or Burn type decks uh, could be put in that category too, guys. But what I prefer personally is I prefer uh, control type decks like Gravekeepers. You know, maybe that's probably why Gravekeepers are my, one of my, my number one deck ever. But I just like the control aspect, aspect where you, the player has to play, you know, dance to your tune. They either have to destroy Necro Valley, get around Necro Valley, do something to stop that card because Necro Valley stops so many decks out there, really, when you think about it. And there's just so many different types of. Gravekeeper type decks out there. There's a whole variation I can, you know, from putting Dark Worlds and Gravekeepers together to Gravekeeper Malefics. There's a whole variation of Gravekeeper decks out there, and each person runs them differently. But I like control type decks, make my opponent dance to my tune, make them do what I want to do, but I do like spammy type decks that like uh, Six Samurais, but I also like the fact that back when Sheen was at three, it kind of was. I guess you could say it was kind of controlling because you could say negate, 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 you know, when she, when she was at three. But I know some of you guys are probably going to hate me for bringing that up, but whatever. I love my six samurai, you know, you guys know why. But today, guy, what I want to ask you now is what is your favorite type of deck? What type of playing style do you like playing? Do you like playing spammy, uh, control, stun, 
uh, OTK type decks, funky decks, you know, unique decks. What type of decks do you like playing and why do you like playing those decks, guys? So I look forward to seeing your comments down below. I'll try to comment or respond to these comments. Google Plus, guys, is not letting me, you know, respond to some of you guys' comments, so please forgive me, guys. I did not mean for that to happen. Uh, <laughs> but till next time, everybody, take care, have fun dueling, good luck dueling, and oh, one more thing before I forget. I apologize for not uploading yesterday. I had some call trouble. And also, guys, uh, I'm going to upload another video today, probably around 3 or 4 o'clock. It'll probably be a deck profile on Watts. Uh, because tomorrow I will not be uploading a video, so that will be my video upload for tomorrow. Uh, this is due to the fact that I have to study big time for my finals coming up. So, college, you know what I mean, guys. But take care, guys, and have fun out there. Good luck dueling to you, all of you guys. Till next time, take care, everybody. Seto Kaiba, I'm out of here, guys.